Ladies and gentlemen, from the writing I've just displayed to you on the screen, it is what we call the state capture, where the Nandi Senator Cheregei calls out Martha Komi over finance bill was. <laughs> Yesterday's video, I tried to reflect what is going to happen in this Republic of Kenya. That the wand of the judiciary of financial suffocation in the coming days, where the court is trying to convince the Kenya over, is bringing a lot of tension to most of politicians in Kenya Kwanzaa. The Finance Act was stopped by Okia Mtata and now it has led to the threat of the judiciary. Not only the Nadi Senator, but I also shared with you a video of Gladys Boss Sholei. <laughs> So, in this analysis of today I'm sharing with you guys this afternoon, I want us to check on the key point. What can be the secret behind this every day, now and then, and then war over this Finance Act? And I will be right to say what is cooking and why is it cooking in this Kenya Kwanzaa government. But before I proceed with this analysis, if this is your first time you are watching me, kindly take a one second and click the subscriptions button and subscribe the channel. In that next time when I upload to you such kind of a video, the video will automatically come to your YouTube platform and we believe you will enjoy watching it. To the members, I'm still welcoming you to the home of various political analysis. And I still want to take this golden chance to thank you for your support over your subscriptions, likes, and also comment. May you continue with the same spirit as we move on to this, our YouTube platform, Zion Kenya TV. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, this afternoon. And in the proceedings, Justice Sunday established the matter and they had weighed, weighed and needed to be determined in a manner that that does not expose the helpless citizen to the punitive taxing measures. This Finance Act is majorly the truth to be told. At this point, it is being driven back by William Samoy Ruto. Because he cannot expose himself, he must use the back door. And using the back door is using these people I've mentioned. Remember, these are very close associate people with the president. They always work in parliament, they always go to the state house then what next if this bill is going to be successfully passed it had been passed but stopped and this stop which was made by Okiamtad has brought a lot of tension in Kenya Kwanzaa and most leaders in Kenya Kwanzaa were having determination therefore the key point why uh, Nandi Senator Cheregai is trying to create threat is that he knows very well that there is something that he has been promised by the head of state. Number two is trying to look the popularity. Number three, these are the key point. This man is having intention on this finance act number four 
or number five. This man is trying to reflect that they are owning Kenya with or without the demands of people's concept which are always sought in decision making. As, as well as or as long as they are trying to tell us that there will be no man, money to fund the lifestyle of judicial officials. This is just buying of time. But the reality remains that these people are just playing hide and seek with the current opposition. And they want this finance bill to buy time in order for them to pass them. So that is why William Samuel Ruto is trying to send these young gentle politicians. Last week was Gladys Boss Sholei. Yesterday was Nandi Senator. He is trying to use his people to convince the judiciary and give them threat that if this bill you are going to fail it, then you are at your wrong side path. Remember the 50th years was not passed as they were expecting. So our eyes are aiming. What can be this, the message coming from Cheregei? the Nandi senator to the judiciary. What can that one tell you? The reality, even the deputy president is aware of this. They are trying to convince the MPs from Kenya Kwanzaa. And this is going to be a very long war if this finance act is not going to be passed. Okia Mtata is bringing sleepless night to Kenya Kwanzaa. That is the reality. And this finance bill was... <laughs> I don't know if it is going to bring peace in this, our country. What are your conclusions on this Cheregei message to Mata Komi? You can as well drop your comment at the comment section below. Meanwhile, I want to sojourn my analysis this afternoon. As I wish you all the best waiting for your comment at the comment section. Bye bye as we hope to meet in the next video. Thank you.